Hi, everybody. Who want to join me on a mixed up adventure? Who's going to help me mix it up? Mix it up, mix it up. I can't hear you. Mix it up, mix it up. Let's go mix it up. I want to do it. But until I can build a new junk shack, I got nowhere to live. Uh, don't be silly. You can stay with me. Like I said the day I built my house, my home is your home. Oh, you're a peach. Ooh. Thanks, Ruby. <laughs> <laughs> Say, pal, ready to welcome our new roommate? Oh, uh, don't worry, boy. Pete just needs a place to stay for a little while. It'll be nice to share our home with him. Oh, wow. What was that? Whoa! Hiya, Mickers. Hope you don't mind me moving your heap. I like to park near the door at home. And since your home is my home, I figured I'd make myself at home. <laughs> Sweet digs, pal. Now where is that piggy hole? Why blow Here it is. See, if I really want to feel at home, I gotta put up my picture of Mama. I also brought my favorite brand of sardines, stinky fish. <laughs> yup. <laughs> Pluto, what's wrong? <laughs> it's okay, boy. It's nice that you're sharing your toy with Butch. That's what good roommates do. Oh, yeah. Oh, looky. A welcome sandwich. Oh, uh, I was just about to have lunch. And... Ooh, not bad. Could have used more pickles. Stan, he's gonna be swell. <laughs> oh, cheer up, P Dog. You're welcome to share Butch's accordion chew toy anytime you want. <laughs> oh, boy, oh, boy. It's time for our favorite show. Row! <laughs> Hello, food and roadster fans. Welcome to Hot Dogs and Hot Rods. Woo! With your host, me, Billy Beagle. Say, Pete, you're welcome to come join us to watch some TV. Oh, thank you kindly, Rumi. Heads up, Butchie. It's TV time. Ooh, that looks yummy. Thanks. Can't wait to watch our favorite show. Crash him, smash him, derpy. Mama Beagle here! Wow, we 
got us a slam man show. I'll tell you what, we got plenty of vehicles, and they're gonna get fast, I'll tell you what. Oh, golly, looks like fun, Peter. But maybe we could share the remote? Well, sure, Mixter. You can change the channel just as soon as our show's over. Settle in, roomies. It's gonna be a long, loud night. last night. I'm making pancakes for us and our new roomies. Rise and shine, it's pancake time. Who wants griddle cake? Hey, I think I was sleepwalking last night and took your blanket, Mickey. Sorry. <laughs> Shower time. Chattering so much, I can't understand a word you're saying. We need to have a roommate meeting right away! Sure thing, Mixter. Right after Butch and me play our song. Butchie, grab your accordion chew toy. I love the way Butchie plays his accordion chew toy along with me. For a Pooch, he's real talented. What's up, boy? Your toy's missing! <laughs> you think Pluto took it? <laughs> now, hold on, fellas. Pluto's no thief. Pluto, why don't you and Butch keep looking for the toy while Pete and I have a little chat? Mm, sounds kind of reasonable like, I guess. <whistles> you go first. Well, uh, since you and Butch moved in, things have been a bit, uh, messy. So maybe Butch's toy got lost in all the mess. Yeah, I guess I did bring in a lot of stuff. <laughs> like Pluto said, we've been sharing our home with you, but you guys haven't exactly been doing your part. What do you mean? I was just about to share my accordion music with you. And thank you for that. But. Butch drank Pluto's water and ate his food and... It totally destroyed his chew toy. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And Pete, you... Ate your sandwich, hogged the TV, took your blanket... And ate all the pancakes. And ate all the pancakes. Wowzers. I really have been a rotten roomie. <laughs> Woo! Butch's <laughs> toy! <laughs> it sounds like it's coming from the chest. <laughs> <gasps> Sneaky, squeaky weasels. That old possum is living large with all our stuff, even Butchie's toy. He's in the zippity doo da thingy. Hurry, boost me up to the zip line, Pete. Oh, nice try. Keep going. You're doing great. Hot dog. Gotcha, possum. Hand over that toy. Thanks. 
Nice! Make it for the treehouse! <laughs> Way to go, Butch! And now, let's catch that possum! Way to go, Ruby. We showed that junkyard old possum what's what, did we? <laughs> Has he ever heard of Sharon? Why, he was taking all our stuff and keeping it all to himself. Oh, yeah. <laughs> like Butchie says, just like me and him been doing to you and Pluto. Uh, can you forgive us? <laughs> sure. Okay, Mr. Possum. I hope you've learned your lesson. Stealing stuff is not okay. <laughs> From now on, Pete and Butch are gonna be great roommates. And you could be too. What do you say? Welcome, processed meat and roadster fans, to hot dogs and hot rods. Dinner time! Oh boy, oh boy! <laughs> Ta-da! All our favorites, hot dogs with sardines! <laughs> 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 Yep, we really love sardines. <laughs> Come on, everybody. Let's go! It's dance break time at Hot Dog. Let's go! Get up, get up, and reach for the sky. Jump up, jump up, jump up on the couch. Who's up? Get in the funny bus. Uh -huh. Get in the funny bus. Right now. Oh. Oh. Everyone is family, and we love to play. Yeah. But helping is our business. a big problem. I've had a statue made to celebrate my wonderful great-grandparents who built this hotel, but we had a little oopsie. Accidentally filled my hotel with cement. If this wasn't bad enough, my family's coming today for a big reunion. Well, with your family coming, this is the perfect time to help with the remodeling. We're on our way. Let's go! Happy helpers! You made it! And we brought our friend Jack. Jack Hammer, that is. Oh, biscuits! Daisy, wait! Thanks, Mr. Whoops! Quakers, those are heavy. Huh. I've been trying to make my great-grandfather Dogwood's famous elderberry honey biscuits, but these got covered in cement. Buttons and bows. Let's get rid of this cement and get redecorating. Oh, sounds fun. And hopefully we'll be on time for my family reunion. I'll get Jack started. He's got a lot to do. Tell us more about your family, Mr. Doozy. Well, my great-grandparents Dogwood and Dandelion Doozy built this hotel because they love to travel. They've explored deserts, beaches, and... <laughs> but jungles are their favorite. <laughs> My sister Nina, scuba dive. My nephew Charlie, crazy about outer space. And Aunt Beatrice is wild about roller coasters. Well, maybe we can add special touches to the guest rooms for your family to enjoy when they're here. That sounds great. Doodles, Jack, you're taking forever. Sorry, but you're fired. This job needs a lady's touch. Molly the Mallet. That's no lady. Run for cover! <gasps> hey, it actually worked. Look, a room. Wow, I never knew this extra room was here. We can fix it up and find a wonderful use for it. 
Oh, that sounds terrific. Well, it looks like you've got things well in hand. I'll go whip up a new batch of Dogwood's biscuits and try to get that recipe right. Dogwood and Dandelion will stay in this guest room when they visit. Let's decorate it to celebrate what they love the most. Jungles! What do you think? Too many vines? Too many? I was gonna say not enough! Woohoo! Oh, my biscuits! Sorry, Mr. Doozy. Oh, that's okay. Wow, my guests will love this room, especially my great-grandparents. Elderberry honey biscuit? I, I'm not tasting elderberry, or honey, or even biscuit. I think you made a croissant. Uh, well, I'll give it another try. Now this guest room should include what little Charlie loves, which is outer space! <laughs> This room is space-tastic. Charlie's gonna love it, and so will the guests. And look, I found Dogwood's biscuit recipe. Eggs, sugar, bologna, soap. Oh, wait, this is my grocery list. It's back to the kitchen for me. Keep up with the good work. Since Aunt Nina loves to scuba dive, let's decorate this guest room like under the sea. Let's dive in. Oh, boy. If I was staying at this hotel, I'd ask for this room. Just one more finishing time. Hey, who turned the lights off? Sorry, Mr. Doozy. Well, look at this. Now, try these. I think I got the recipe right this time. I'm not sure about biscuits, but they sure make good tennis balls. Oh, no. They're supposed to be light and flaky. Hmm. I better get this right. My family will be here soon. Come on, girls. Only one bedroom and the extra room left. Now this one should feature Aunt Beatrice's love for roller coasters. But there's no room for a roller coaster and a bed. Unless we build our roller coaster bed. <laughs> But it rocks! Oh, buttons and bows, look at the time. We still have to decorate the lobby and the extra room. A new batch of biscuits is almost done, Happy Helpers. And I think this is the one. Wonderful, Mr. Doozy. We'll be working on the lobby. Bye-bye. <laughs> there. One room left to decorate. Happy Helpers, you've done an incredible job. This looks amazing. And so do those biscuits. Here's a new batch. Try one. Mm. These are the best elderberry honey biscuits I've ever had. Oh, thank you. I finally got the recipe right, although I feel like they're still missing something. Well, my family will be here soon. I'll make sure everything is ready. I'm serious. He should serve these biscuits to his guests here at the hotel. But where is he going to serve them? Daisy, are you thinking what I'm thinking about what we should do with the extra room? Um, yeah. Oh, I don't believe it. A cafe for the hotel? That's wonderful. Well, you needed a place to serve your biscuits. Happy helpers, this is great. My entire hotel is a celebration of all that my family loves. Oh. I've got just enough time to make one more batch. <gasps> Would you look at this? Ooh, it's Great Grandpa Dogwood and Great Grandma Dandelion. Hey, looks just like them, too. Nina, Aunt B, Charlie, you're here. So wonderful to see you. Uh, where are Dogwood and Dandelion? Right here, dear Dempsey. And I love the statue. Oh, I'm so glad. What does Great Grandpa think? <laughs> oh, dear. Dogwood must have wandered off. You know how he is, always exploring. Well, come on in, everyone. I've got a big surprise for you. Is this the snoozy doozy? Looks more like the snazzy dazzy. 
Dempsey, it's lovely! Dogwood and I had so many plans for this hotel, but we got so busy traveling. And the happy helpers made it all possible. Minnie, Daisy, and Cuckoo Loca. It's a pleasure to meet you. Mr. Doozy's told us all about you. In fact, we did a little custom decorating. Wanna see? Well, oh, oh, boy, yes. I can't wait! <gasps> oh, stop it! This reminds me of some of my greatest scuba dives. Whoa! I get to stay in this room? Awesome! I'm an astronaut! All systems go! Blast off! You have got to be kidding! I've seen a lot of roller coasters in my day, but never like this! Take her for a spin! Come on, Charlie! Back so many memories of our adventures through the jungles. Thank you, Dempsey. Isn't it great? Each room reflects something about our family. And I have one more surprise for you. And now, for the final touch to the remodeled Snoozy Doozy Hotel. Ta-da! The Snoozy Doozy Cafe. <gasps> A cafe? But how did you know? Know what? When Dogwood and I built the hotel, we planned to add a cafe, but we never had the time. Just walled it over, but you completed our dream! <sighs> it's a Christmas miracle! Daisy, it's not Christmas. What? Oh, Doodles, I need to update my calendar. It's summer, Daisy. Well, the hotel may be complete, but not the family reunion. Great Grandpa Dog was gonna miss out on the special treats I made. Oh, no, I'm not! Sorry, Sonny Boy. Oh, Great Grandpa! As soon as I got here, I smelled my elderberry honey biscuits and couldn't stop myself. Mr. Doozy's been baking all day trying to get them right. They're almost perfect. Biscuits in the oven, make plenty of them. And, and don't, don't forget, forget the, the sugar, sugar and the cinnamon. Cinnamon! <laughs> of course, that's what they were missing. Whoa! To, to the, the cafe! cafe. We did it! <laughs> <laughs> Stop on the floor. 